Welcome to the On Deck Podcast presented by Line Star, your best MLB props for today on Underdog Fantasy and Prize Picks alongside Tyler Weeman. I'm Shannon Somerville. If you hear some panting too, we've got yeah. a dog in the studio. Maybe a, you might see a tail wagging around in the background. Harley is in the studio. Yep. Glad to have Special your dog appearance. with us. Awesome. So, Tyler, yesterday I let us down for the squad and mm-hmm. our That's prop okay. bets. Hello. Um, so, yesterday, my guys. The Yankees let us down. DJ LeMahieu did not do anything for us with that over on 1.5 hits, runs, and RBIs. The Yankees in general just did not do anything. And then my bonus, Ryan Nota, didn't hit either. However, you've been on a tear as of late. bad picking on you yesterday, but it was the right call. You know what? It's okay because you know what, Tyler? Today is Friday, so I'm going to be picking True. on you as well. we got oh. got to fade your team sometimes, and uh, especially on a day where the Dodgers are facing them. Ouch. <laughs> Just a little tease of what's ahead. We'll have your prop Ouch. bets and home run calls. Now we That's are I get, up. Though, I get, we're right? still good, though. We're still good on the year, yeah. up 11 units on the year on Underdog Fantasy and Prize Pick, which is no easy task, mind you, okay? It's tough to get those double parlays on Prize Picks and Underdog Fantasy. If you don't already have those apps, Make sure to download them. Use the promo code LINESTAR, and you'll get up to $100 of your first deposit match. Check that out. Also, we've got our contest going on. We've given out a lot of money this season on the On Deck podcast. All you have to do is make sure you like this video. You're subscribed to our channel, and you comment below, and you're automatically entered in. It is Flex Friday, which means if we hit four of our props, one randomly selected commenter wins $100. If we hit just our two main props, someone gets fifty dollars. So big day. Big day. Big day. Big Friday. Casual yep. Friday. Rocking the sweatshirt here today for my New York mm-hmm. Knicks, who are uh, game six tonight, baby. Let's big game. do it. See, big game. If we, huh, I'm a little nervous because I heard Jimmy Butler saying he's going to play 48. I was like, oh, great. Yeah, this and might be a rough one. And he's probable. <laughs> Instead of questionable for the first oh, time. Oh boy! In a couple games, so full he's strength, ready to go. Full strength, Jimmy in the playoffs. Mm-hmm. What everyone wants to be facing. All right, but let's get back to baseball here and start with our props of the day here on Underdog Fantasy and Prize Picks. Tyler, where are you headed for your main prop for today? Uh, my first prop is going to be JP France over 1.5 walks. So he had his first start. He only had one walk, but this is a guy that in the minors has a 4.2 walk per nine rate. I don't see that getting better magically yeah. just because he's in the major leagues. The White Sox are bad at walks taken, but with a line like 4.2 per nine, I just don't see, you know, mm-hmm. I, I think he they can still get plenty of walks. So I think going over here is the call. All right. I'm going to Coors Field for mine. And I'm going mm-hmm. with Philadelphia Philly slugger Nick Castellanos. Over one and a half bases at minus 130. Castellanos has been on a tear mm-hmm. lately, batting over 400 the last seven days. He's gone over that number seven of the last 10 games. That's pretty good. Also, this is a batter who's a lefty batter going up against a lefty, and he's got much better splits, actually. 982 OPS versus lefties, and he'll be facing Colorado lefty Austin Gomber, who's Worse versus lefty bats, a 333 average. He's also worse at Coors Field where this game is today. We've got the Colorado bullpen. They rank 20th in opponent average. And I mentioned that Coors Field. The weather's not great at Coors Field today. We've got wind blowing in. However, the altitude will still make this a high-scoring game. And so I love Cassianos. He has great numbers at Coors Field in nine games, batting 432 with Eight extra base hits, including three home runs. I love Castellanos Not for today. Bad. Great spot for him here. So going Castellanos over one and a half bases. Mm-hmm. Let's do it. I like it. Let's get crazy. It's Flex Friday. We got some bonuses. Kind of funny. We're taking a lot of 1.5s today. Yeah. I usually we try, to, do. try to pick off the 0.5. When I was looking at 0.5 bases and hits, which is what I usually go to, mm-hmm. I just found that when I looked into it, the splits just weren't advantageous to the hitters today yeah. so that's Makes why I go with the best hitter on one of the top matchup tools or top players on the matchup tool on line star is castellanos he's yep. in the top five there well i'm going with a guy with has a very good matchup as well we're going jordan alvarez over 1.5 total bases against michael kopech kopech is allowing 53 percent hard contact alvarez absolutely destroys righties and he's been hot over the last week, hitting 360 and two home runs. So, Alvarez, it's your day to shine. All right. I mentioned at the top of the show that I was going to be 
you know, it's Fade Tyler Friday. So I'm going. Good thing that doesn't <laughs> ring. I'm going to Dodgers outfielder James Outwood over 0.5 bases. Now, actually, the juice a little bit favoring the under in this one, mm-hmm. minus 20, 123 to the under. However, Outman's still a pretty good hitter, Tyler. He I got to go his way here. Outman's gone over this number 63% of the time this season. He's gone over seven of the last 10. And this is a batter with a 333 average versus lefty going up against your boy. Uh, Snellzilla, mm-hmm. Blake Snell's a lefty who actually gives up a 250 opponent average this season. He's a decent pitcher when he's dialed in. He's yep. hard to hit, but I got Outman here, uh, mainly because I just wanted to fade you on a Friday, but also because Outman has delivered for us a lot this season on that 0.5 basis. Perhaps he's a high strikeout guy, has seen some aggression over the past couple of weeks. You know, he's coming back down to earth a little bit, but for one mm-hmm. one hit, that's all we need from what him. What a nice co-host you are. Eh. Just because I want to fade you, I'm I mean, you, it. you did go after my <laughs> Yankees yesterday, which, you know. Yes, yes. It proved to be correct. So, uh, it's fu- it's but fun. you know what I'm looking forward to is if Outman does not get a hit, <laughs> and I'm going to get a text tonight <laughs> that's going to just read "suck it, Outman," because that's what happened to me you, last Friday. You would, you would, Friday. and hopefully <laughs> you're at a comedy show again. And <laughs> either yeah. way, that is my comedy show. Yes. Getting texts from Tyler. All right, I do have one more bonus prop for you guys. Ooh. I know it's Flex Friday. We're trying to fill that ticket, and mm-hmm. I'm going with Pittsburgh's Rodolfo Castro over point five bases minus 130 he has gone over this 61 percent of the time seven of the last 10 decent matchup against baltimore orioles righty kyle bradish she's got a 595 era this season 309 opponent average so he gives up a ton of contact castro is better versus lefties like significantly better in fact they kind of sit him sometimes against uh when he's facing righties however i still like this play for him if he is in the lineup today i like the conditions at camden yards it's over 80 degrees there are some nice hitter conditions and castro has been great this year for the pirates so i like castro's spot here today just to get one knock for us i think that's doable he can do it all right So those are our bonus props. Remember, you can tail us on the Underdog Fantasy and Prize Picks app. And when you do, make sure to use the promo code LINESTAR. If you don't already have that app, you'll get up to $100 of your deposit match. Again, enter into our Prop Bets contest. We want you guys to win some money. All you got to do, like this video, subscribe to our channel, comment below. We're giving out $100 if we hit all four of our props, or four of the five. Mm -hmm. And $50 if we hit our two main props. So that's... What's up for grabs? We've got to give out Monday. We've been giving out Monday. we got to use the, the nice cash gun we've got in the studio. Mm-hmm. We'll have it locked and loaded for Monday. So good luck in all your Flex Friday picks on prize picks as well. All right. Now it's time for our home run calls of the day. Tyler, where are you headed for a bomb today? I'm going with Jordan Alvarez, plus 240 to hit a bomb today. Kopech has a 53% hard hit rate. He's allowing 2.9 home runs per nine. Mm -hmm. He's been getting blown up. Meanwhile, Jordan Alvarez crushes righties, Mm -hmm. and he's going to do it again today for his ninth of the year. Uh, You mentioned Kopech, that Mm 2.9 home run per nine rate. That is second highest among all pitchers, minimum 30 innings pitched. I'm going up against the guy who is number one. (laughs) Now, I'm taking Rangers third baseman Josh Young at plus 390 for a bomb. He has eight home runs on the season, and today a righty bat with a 366 ISO versus lefties over the last three seasons and going up against A's lefty Ken Waldachek, who's got a three home run per nine rate. That is the highest among all pitchers, minimum 30 innings pitch, plus that Oakland bullpen. They have the fifth highest home run per nine rate. So just that combination, I think things are looking really good for those Rangers bats today, but specifically Josh Young. Yeah, and if you get past the uh, starter, you have that Oakland bullpen. Oh, and it's great to pretty miserable but a lot mm-hmm. a really fun slate today and i know you're gonna be breaking it down in your daily fantasy yes. preview so make sure you Should tune in for one. that also we have been getting a lot of comments from you guys about the props ai tool which is what we use to pick out our props every day and so we did a little tutorial about kind of our process how we go about picking our props on that tool so if you guys are online star and using the tool Uh, We want to help you guys out. And so we'll show you kind of how we use the odds to our favor and how we've been winning money because Tyler and I have both been profitable this year, up 11 Mm -hmm. units on our show picks. So looking good there. Anything else to add there? We've got a great show for you today coming up with Tyler on the Daily Fantasy. And good luck in all of your sports betting endeavors for today. We'll see you guys on Monday. Have a good one, guys. Bye.